we have two more objects that have come through and they have some weird properties. The brightness, the rotation rate, and so they don't match some of our models for what comets and asteroids should do. Whatever anomalous behavior these objects exhibit, I'm delighted that they're finally in the catalog and we'll figure it out one day, maybe. And while my first thought is not that it's aliens, I promise you that is one of my thoughts, but it'll be last on the list. It's easier for me to recognize that interstellar objects are fundamentally different from anything we've studied in the solar system before. So we have to derive a new understanding of what an object can be as it moves from one star system to the next. It's easier for me to think this is a new kind of object that requires way more study than we've given it thus far than to say, aliens did it. Aliens, based on my read of history, and I do a lot of reading of history, I have a certain resistance to swapping out God of the Gaps and replacing it with Alien of the Gaps.